Action. So tonight, I'm going to start side control attacks again. We're going to start with some basic ones, and as the weeks progress, we're going to go to some more advanced ones. We'll probably finish the season off with ankle locks, with an ankle lock series. So this next like two months, side control attacks, and then some ankle locks. So let's go back to the principle of side control. You're on your back. Let's say I do a nice, quick, um, he's got his legs up here. I'm going to defend, of course. Say I want you know, a, quick, a quick pass, and I'm going to side control. When you guys are going down, you need to get there as soon as you can. You need to be tight. So when I come in, I want my shin, my knees against me. I want to come in here. I want to lock my hands with the gable grip, snug it in, turn, turn, turn. See how my knees are up, tight. All the way in here. I see a lot of guys, you're out right here. Back, put me back in guard, quick. Boom, right back in guard. You got to be tight. You got to establish the position. Think about that. The difference between catch wrestling and jiu-jitsu. Jiu-jitsu is about position, submission. Catch wrestling is fast. You go, you catch the submissions anywhere. But for right now, guys, I want you to work just on establishing that position. And as, as you get better, you can be more spontaneous with your uh, submission. So, I'm going to get tight. Oh, this is where I want to be. Head and arm control. We're just going to do a basic key lock. Where's Matt's other, other hand is somewhere in here. So I'm in here. I'm going to sit through real quick. I'm going to deal with this hand right here. You guys see that? I'm pressure. Got this wrist. Now I'm going to go back here. I've nullified that arm. A new guy, or a street fight, or a new guy in grappling, wrestling, whatnot, for this position, he's going to take his hand, put it in my face. And he's going to, who's had this happen to me before? A new guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this position, I'm just going to quickly stuff the arm, stuff it, the elbow right in his face. Look at that. Is it pinned with my knee shin right there? Yeah. My knee pinned, both hands down like this. Keep your hand down. Knees are tight. Take this. It's like a self-defense. Come in here. Now, don't try to do this, even though it might work. What do you do with the game? Point it down. Elbow down here. This is so tight. Matt's freaking out. Now watch. Watch the little baby steps. What is this? You okay? Mm -hmm. Boom. From right here. Who's real flexible? Who's super flexible? Mm -hmm. And Donnie, come out here. I don't want to break Nico. He's a little so, okay. so I come down here. I got the gable grip. Established position. A lot of times you might just get this. This is still good. But if I can get here, this is the great position. So if you can, let's, let's trap that arm. Boom. I'm still tight. Try to get this arm if you can. Even up here, look at it. I even bring it up here. I still, I still have it. Can you get that arm out, Donnie? No. Oh, that arm's trapped. He's trying to figure out you know, a way to get it out. So from here, excuse me, I'm just going to take it, put my head down, all this pressure, knees in, slide it. Once you bring it here, you really feel the difference. Up to here, you didn't feel that, Donnie? Watch this. Boom. Careful, hit me there. Boom. And if you want to really hurt a guy, which we don't want to do ever, this is a matter of life and death, you keep this key lock. You sit your hips out. You see what I just did? This is the catch hold. This will rip. This is bad. Now imagine me going 100% this way. What would happen to Don's shoulder? Rip out. He might not, he'd probably never be the same guy ever again. Ever, ever again. So let's quickly review. Yeah, on, face me, Don, on your back. So let's see, you know, if we pass and we come in, you guys want to look at, look at my knees, how they just stuck, stuck onto them. Put me, try to heavy up. <laughs> always keep my knees right there so he can't get up. Keep your knees tight. Let's go back. How many of you guys have worked for a pass? You got here and immediately they put you back in guard. It's horrible. It's like, it's discouraging. It's discouraging. So, okay, so Donnie's down. You don't have to trap the arm. But if you don't trap the arm, He's got the other arm. Where's it at? What's the other one? He's going to start doing elbow push escape, which is the counter. We don't want to do the elbow push escape. I want to quickly trap that. Boom, I can even, I can even hold it here. What are you going to do with that arm, Donnie? Boom. Head down. 
right here to the hips and boom, right there. Thank you, Gene. Matt Jules, let's see your superior take.